Nehemiah chapter 11 The princes of the people lived in Jerusalem. The rest of the people also cast lots to bring one of ten to dwell in Jerusalem, the holy city, and nine parts in the other cities. The people blessed all the men who willingly offered themselves to dwell in Jerusalem. Now these are the chiefs of the province who live in Jerusalem. But in the cities of Judah everyone lived in his possession in their cities, Israel, the priests, the Levites, the temple servants, and the children of Solomon's servants. Some of the children of Judah and of the children of Benjamin lived in Jerusalem. Of the children of Judah, Hathiah, the son of Uzziah, the son of Zechariah, the son of Amariah, the son of Shephatiah, the son of Mahalalel, of the children of Perez, and Maaseiah, the son of Beirut, the son of Kolhose, the son of Hosea, the son of Adaiah, the son of Joyarib, the son of Zechariah, the son of Shilonite. All the sons of Perez who lived in Jerusalem were 468 valiant men. These are the sons of Benjamin, Salu, the son of Meshulam, the son of Joed, the son of Padeah, the son of Koliah, the son of Maaseiah, the son of Ithiel, the son of Jesheah. After him, Gabai, Salai, 928. Joel, the son of Zikri, was their overseer. And Judah, the son of Hasanua, was second over the city. Of the priests, Jadeah, the son of Joyarib, Jachin, Zareah, the son of Hilkiah, the son of Meshulam, the son of Zadok, the son of Mireah, the son of Ahitub, the ruler of Elohim's house. And their brothers, who did the work of the house 822, and Adaiah the son of Jeroham, the son of Pilauiah, the son of Amzai, the son of Zechariah, the son of Pasher, the son of Malchiah, and his brothers, chiefs of fathers' households, 242, and Amashai, the son of Azarel, the son of Azai, the son of Meshilamoth, the son of Emmer and their brothers, mighty men of valor, 128. And their overseer was Zabdiel, the son of Hagedolim. Of the Levites, Shemaiah, the son of Hashab, the son of Azrakam, the son of Hashabiah, the son of Bunai. And Shabbathai and Josabad, of the chiefs of the Levites, who had the oversight of the outward business of Elohim's house. Mataniah, the son of Micah, the son of Zabdi, the son of Asaph, who was the chief to begin the thanksgiving and prayer, and Bakbukiah, the second among his brothers, and Abda, the son of Shemua, the son of Galal, the son of Jedathan. All the Levites in the holy city were 284. Moreover, the porters, Akub, Talman, and their brothers, who kept watch at the gates, were 172. The residue of Israel of the priests, the Levites, were in all the cities of Judah, everyone in his inheritance. But the temple servants lived in Ophel, and Ziha and Gishpeh were over the temple servants. The overseer also of the Levites at Jerusalem was Uzai, the son of Bani, the son of Hashabiah, the son of Mataniah, the son of Micah, of the sons of Asaph, the singers, over the business of Elohim's house. For there was a commandment from the king concerning them, and a settled provision for the singers, as every day required. Pethahiah the son of Meshezabel, of the children of Zerah, the son of Judah, was at the king's hand in all matters concerning the people. As for the villages with their fields, some of the children of Judah lived in Kiriath Arba and its towns, in Dibon and its towns, in Jacabzeel and its villages. And Jeshua, and Molada, Beth Pilet, and Hazer Shual, and Beersheba, and its towns, and Ziklag, and Mikona, and in its towns, in En Ramon, and Zora, and Jarmuth, Zanoa, Adullam, and their villages, Lachish, and its fields, and Azica, and its towns. So they encamped from Beersheba to the valley of Hinnom. The children of Benjamin also lived from Geba onward, at Michmash and Aya, and at Bethel and its towns, at Anathoth, Nob, 
Anania, Hazor, Rama, Gateam, Hadid, Zeboim, Mebalat, Lod, and Ono, the Valley of Craftsmen. Of the Levites, certain divisions in Judah settled in Benjamin's territory.